so today I'm in the law library. Um, I showed you guys how I kind of fill out some of the forms in my apartment, but I sometimes I get to like a standstill where I basically need to figure out how to file something. I don't know how to file it. And so what I do is I come to the law library with like my questions and a very general understanding of the problem um, that I have. I typically have some notes. So like, I'll just show you guys. This is like one of my notebooks. I have um, like a letter here from like uh, the opposing counsel from one of the cases that's open for me right now. Now in this letter, there's a bunch of civil codes. So basically, um, one of these is the, okay. It's not that one. Okay, so this is like Wes's book of annotated California codes. Now they literally gave me a number of the code that they were referring to. So it was like 430.1. So I have to like look in this book under like 430.1. Um, I didn't really know how to do this. I had to like ask the clerk about how to do it. Um, and there's an entire section of pleadings that explains what this code is. Um, some of you guys know that I have a couple like civil cases like unlawful discrimination, uh, like employment suits happening. So then there's this folder that I'm looking at to figure out basically how to file those um so yeah it's a lot of paperwork across the street we actually have like a family law um center um i typically file all of my civil matters in oakland um but i guess you know spending this much time just kind of like understanding the different civil codes how to um, maneuver, I suppose, like different parts of the legal system here has really encouraged me to go to law school. Um, I've been looking at Tulsa a lot just because like, I think the type of lawyer that I'd want to be is like um, a civil rights attorney. I think I, there's a big need for that. And I think I could potentially apply for grant funding and really try to serve underserved communities. Um, just because I have like a bit of time, I'll give you guys kind of like a tour of this library really quick. So, um, yeah, there's kind of like some flyers up there where you guys can kind of see stuff. If you don't have your own laptop, that's fine. You can work off of these computers and they have a whole bunch of like databases, like Westlaw already on the computer. A lot of attorneys just work here. Um, they have like, you know, books you can search through and read. There's typically not very many people um, in this library who actually come and work. And then these are like all of the cases in the state of California. Um, so you could, you know, look at that. I told you guys about those civil codes that I've been parsing through and like judicial conduct. So there's like, you know, workers' compensation laws and child welfare services manuals, civil codes. I was down here um, kind of looking at workforce discrimination. I think it might have been over there. Um, so yeah. I don't know how helpful that is for you guys but i just wanted to show you it's just a short little video on that hope you guys enjoy hope you're having a more productive day than me <laughs>